Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Ari. I'm a Taurus Sun, Cancer Rising, Aquarius Moon, and a Life Path number seven. If you're not new here, thank you for watching another video of mine and choosing to support me further. It does mean a lot to me. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe before you do leave this video, especially if you're able to relate or connect with this message. So today, everyone, I'm here with a channeled messages reading from your person for all of my Virgos watching. So if you have Virgo as your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or anywhere in your chart, this message might apply to you. Your person, Virgo, is whoever is currently on your mind right now. You two may be in separation, in communication, may be at a distance from one another. Just whoever in your heart is your person, that's your person, and you'll know. Before I do get into your reading, Virgo, please keep in mind that this will be a general reading for the sign of Virgo, so it may not resonate or relate to you specifically, and if it does not, please don't take it personally. All right, Virgo, so let's go ahead and take a look at what messages we do have from your person. We'll also get some messages regarding the connection you're in currently. So, so far we have been there, done that. I no longer want what you have. Let's go ahead and get a few more cards. We'll get one more card for now. Let's see what we have for Virgo. Okay, Virgo, so we have our first few cards. Before I do get into your reading, please keep in mind that if I'm speaking from your person's perspective or describing how they feel, that could be how you feel the roles could be reversed, just however this reading resonates for you. This is also a timeless love reading, so any energy I am describing throughout it can apply to the past, the present, the future of your connection. And if you're not connected to anyone at this time, Virgo, this could be someone from your past or someone who is coming towards you. But so far we have been there, done that. I no longer want what you have. We also have the moments we spend together seem timeless. I want that feeling forever. Time will tell everything. I hope my worries don't come true. And I'm walking away, leaving what's behind us in the past. So Virgo, I feel like this is in reference to someone from the past, the past connection. Um, I feel like getting to know them, you were optimistic. You were, it made you excited spending time with them, quality time because you're building towards something more permanent. Like that's, that was your intention, Virgo. But I feel like this person showed you their true colors in a way or they really turned you off that to a point where you're not even interested in them maybe not even open to working things out or if this person wanted to reconcile you you wouldn't virgo um it's like that just feeling like why would i get to know this person when they did this, I would have never expected for them to do that. So it's like a disrespect to yourself. So we have the moments we spend together seem timeless. I want that feeling forever. I do feel like this is your energy, Virgo. Just you being excited to get to know this person and knowing that things take time and hoping something for this connection took off eventually. We have time will tell everything. I hope my worries don't come true. I feel like this is also your energy, Virgo. Remember, roles could be reversed, but giving this connection time and maybe your worries did come true. Um, but just knowing to give things time because anything can happen. So maybe leaving space for your emotions to change as this connection changes. We also have, I'm walking away, leaving what's behind us in the past. I feel like this is your energy, Virgo. Also with the been there, done that, I no longer want what you have. Just knowing how this person operates and maybe what caused this ending was all you needed to see and you didn't need it to be continued. So just moving forward and not looking back because this connection doesn't serve you anymore. So Virgo, let's go ahead and get some more cards. 
regarding this person from the past. Um, let's see if there's any new love coming in for Virgo as well. Let's go ahead and get some more cards for Virgo. So we have we have two cards that came out. We'll go ahead and get one more card. We also have love shouldn't be complicated. I'll go ahead and put that back, but perhaps this person just started to make things difficult or you couldn't trust them, Virgo. Yeah, there could have been something with trust, just getting to know this person, but for our next cards we have, I can be weird, I want someone to be close to, but I feel better off alone. Thanks for being sweet throughout it all. We also have, I keep coming back to you because there is no one else like you. And be intentional and don't, don't waste my time. So Virgo, um, what I feel like may have happened within this connection is someone started acting like weird in the way where you couldn't really pinpoint how they were feeling about you or this connection like just like they were not interested anymore and that didn't make you feel ver you feel good Virgo and maybe you were just tired of initiating things um because of your real interest towards them um so they their energy may have dropped and that wasn't okay for you Virgo or you you feel like they were not intentional with getting to know you and that they did waste their, your time, Virgo. We have, I can be weird. I want someone to be close to, but I feel better off alone. I do feel like this is a mutual energy here, Virgo. This person not really making up their mind on if they want to share that sort of energy with someone. And in the meantime, your feelings are growing for this person. So that may have been a reason for this ending. Um, I also feel like this is your energy, Virgo, because once you found out that they couldn't give you what you were looking for, you, you have no problem being alone. Well, I won't, not to speak for all my Virgos, but you'd rather maybe keep your energy to yourself than not be in something with no intention, no goal, no purpose. We have, thanks for being sweet throughout it all. But I'll get started on be intentional and don't waste my time. I feel like this is your energy, Virgo. That this person was not intentional and that's what caused this, this ending or for you to walk away. I keep coming back to you because there is no one else like you. Um, this person that I'm describing, Virgo, I feel like if they have come back and tried to start things up again with you, it's because they they realize where they went wrong and even if this connection was newer they were able to just observe by your actions and how you treated them that you were serious and it, it was nothing towards you that made them act that way Virgo or yeah act that way um so I feel like they feel as though they missed an opportunity and that's why they are coming back and then thanks for being sweet throughout it all. I feel like this is this person's energy to you, Virgo. I feel like you just walked away. You didn't maybe throw any harsh words out to this person. You just kept doing your own thing. So Virgo, we'll go ahead and get the last few cards for your reading. Let's see if we have, or what we have for Virgo regarding this person and also this connection. Okay, Virgo, so we have, do I have an actual chance with you? I fell for you instantly. And we both had to move on for the best. You'll see that soon. So Virgo, um, Aries had two of these cards in their reading. So perhaps you're dealing with an Aries does not have to resonate, but I feel like for some of my Virgos out there, you may have known or felt like this person didn't have time for a connection but maybe their actions and their words described otherwise um or you just maybe have this thought that they weren't as invested as you were with do i have an actual chance with you so maybe if you were prepared to walk away it was because you sensed that this person was maybe a flake 
I fell for you instantly. I feel like this is your energy, Virgo. Just you wanting to pursue this person once you got to know them and being sure about your intentions. But we also have, we both had to move on for the best. You'll see that soon. I feel like this is your energy, Virgo. Even if nothing like bad happened between you two, it was just this person was not on your same agenda. Uh, I feel like you maybe held back your words because if this person were to come around and change things up and really be more direct with you, then maybe you two could see what happens from there. But you don't want to build up any anger or emotions. That's how I feel like you feel, Virgo. But don't let me speak for you. Only take what resonates. Um, I feel you like you didn't offer any argumentative words because... That's not how you truly feel about this person. It's more like this person isn't for you. But Virgo, I will go ahead and leave it at that. That's all I do have for you today. As always, I appreciate the love and support. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will talk to you next time. Bye.